Hello everyone and uh, well I believe it's time for a new video right uh, today I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft uh, Office components well uh, these are right here as you can see them and uh, well Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel uh, even access components and such uh, if you don't have these components you must use this component install packages and you will find here uh, C++ Builder Office 2000 server package and Office XP server package and I recommend you use this XP because I will be using uh, uh, those for my tutorial right so uh, what I want to show you is how uh, to make your application uh, write something inside Microsoft Word document or Microsoft Excel document. So let's start with uh, Microsoft Word. First we need uh, these three uh, components meaning Microsoft Word application component, uh, Word document and Word font. Meaning I will use this component to connect to uh, your Microsoft Word application uh, that is installed in your system and then I will create a new document inside that application and then I will add some lines of text and format them using a uh, font some font right uh, so let's run this application when I click this button Microsoft Word opened and uh, created a new document and wrote 15 lines of text well, 15 numbers inside of uh, that document how did we do that well, let's see. Uh, in order to simplify things, I wrote this function. Uh, so this function pretty much inserts a word of uh, a line of text inside Microsoft Word, and it uses the uh, Microsoft Word document and Microsoft font document, uh, Word font. Okay, these two components. Uh, this is the line of text that we are going to insert inside the document. What font do we want to use? What is the height of the font? Is it bold, italic, underline, shadow? What is the color of the text that we are going to use? And what is the alignment? Meaning the position. So by default, uh, uh, the alignment is going to be left. And once we did all that, uh, well, the rest of the code will simply insert that text and format it a, and format it, it uh, as we requested it will set alignment uh, insert text uh, set the font uh, color and so on so how do we use that uh, function word line so when i click this button first i need to connect uh, to my uh, microsoft word application and for that we use these lines of code we simply try to connect and if you fail to connect uh, well probably Microsoft Word is not installed on that computer uh, this leads us uh, to a fact that if you are going to create something uh, like this then you must assure that your client who runs your application has Microsoft Word or Microsoft Excel uh, whatever do you use uh, installed on its system right and once uh, we checked that uh, we can connect to our Microsoft Word application, uh, we need to add a new document. Okay. And uh, once we uh, connect it uh, to that document, okay, we use this Word component. So uh, we will simply write 15 lines of text inside that document. How are we going to write those lines of text? Well, by using this word line function okay so uh, inside the word document using word font font so this is the word document word font one we are going to write what uh, simple uh, the, uh, the value of this variable here and a new line I'm going to use the Homa and uh, for the first line of text I'm going to use uh, 11 height uh, font height the second uh, line of text will have 12 13 and so on bold italic underline shadow and what is going to be the color of the text okay is here once we write uh, down all these 15 lines of text we will set microsoft word application as visible and that's going to be it so let's run again and once i click this 
we can see it's uh, it pretty much did everything that we requested as we can see the first line is bold and italic and it has the height of 11 second one is 12 but it is only italic bold 13 14 italic uh, bold italic 16 17 and so on pretty much everything that we wanted to do right well let's say five uh, starting from 15 okay so now we just wrote uh, the first five uh, lines of text meaning first five numbers so we started from 16 17 18 19 20 and guys that's pretty much how you can use these microsoft uh, word components in order to open microsoft word application add a new document and inside that document to add uh, lines of text and format them as you see fit right i don't believe it's uh, too hard well pretty much uh, you need to copy paste this function and uh, once you do that uh, well you have an example here how to how to do the rest okay i believe uh, you will uh, try this at home uh, but now now let's see how to use microsoft excel so uh, microsoft excel is even more simpler uh, i will try to connect also it would be uh, useful to have try catch here uh, like in microsoft word okay but you can add it yourself uh, add a new document so for microsoft excel we also need to have a uh, excel application component excel workbook uh, simply represents the excel document and this sheet is nothing but a part of uh, a document okay so uh, what we did we simply created a new document connected to excel and added a new document and uh, well we added a new sheet to that document okay and connected everything so uh, that's pretty much uh, uh, self-explanatory but what really writes uh, the values inside excel document are these lines and uh, here we have uh, this is the row one column a and in there i'm going to write the value of three so in the row two column a i will write value of five so in the third uh, row i will write a formula okay and uh, here we have something cells get range from a3 to a3 so i select a range of one cell from a3 to a3 and set the color of uh, that cell to gray now let's see click on a button and as we can see a1 value of 3 a2 value of 5 a3 it has this okay and i believe it's even easier to work with microsoft excel uh, these examples are not too hard i believe uh, there will be no problems for you to try it yourself uh, you can also simply uh, write the code uh, that I showed you and uh, well I hope it can uh, be of use to you just remember that your clients must have a Microsoft Word or Microsoft Excel installed if you are going to use these features well uh, that's about it uh, I am looking forward to your comments and thank you for watching goodbye